Hello guys, good evening. So today I'm gonna teach you about how to create free screen questionnaire in Oracle Recruiting Cloud. We have two kinds of questions we can create in free screening questionnaire disqualification questions. So here, so without wasting any time, we directly go to that area and we'll show how to create that and we'll explain. We'll go to setup and maintenance as usual. The recruiting and candidate experience, job requisition, all tasks. I forgot <laughs> it comes here. Go to question library. Here you can modify it from performance to not modify, just go to recruiting. Click here question library. And here you can create multiple questions here so i'll go click create so first question you must be asking that why do we create this one what is the need of that sometimes you know what happens uh, recruiter wants to know uh, many information from candidate whether it's about job, whether it's about experience, whether you know some more languages or languages we can also add into the job application flow area. But sometimes, uh, you know, uh, he wants to know more or whether he is eligible to work in US or whether he's having a work permit or visa or needs a sponsor visa. So, so many things, right? So these kind of the questions we can create it into this library area and then it will be attached to the requisition and from there it will flow to the candidate job application flow and where we are using the question block. So through that once candidate would apply the same job and then he will have to answer that. We can do multiple things in question area. We can make it mandatory, we can make it non-mandatory, we have some other stuff, I'll explain here what can we do when we are creating this one. So I'm just keeping the status as active, owner is a courtesy pretty, I am, where I am saving this one, into the question library, privacy, public or private, if I am keeping it public, anyone can use this one, okay. So question text, are you eligible to work in US state? Okay, this is the question. And uh, what is the time? Should be a text or single choice, multiple choice or no response. Text means candidate can text anything, candidate can type and he could answer that. Single choice, like we are giving them multiple, we are giving them maybe answer uh, options yes or no, he could choose one. Multiple choice, if you are having more than uh, two answers and if you want candidate to, uh, candidate, candidate to select uh, more than one, then you can select the multiple choice. So here you can four or five you are giving giving the option and candidate can select more than one no response just for the fyi he doesn't need to do that anything there okay so here i'm just taking a single choice can be uh, this question will be scored or not okay so this question will be scored okay there would be a some weightage okay so once candidate would answer then a score will be mentioned into the candidate job application okay 
this question should be display conditional who is going to control this question suppose you are creating any question like uh, uh, have you ever worked uh, in this company before so if candidate answers yes then all, all of a sudden one another question pops up like okay then what was your employment work? what was your former employment work, right so again when i'm selecting this display the question conditionally it means uh, here would be a controlling question suppose controlling question is uh, have you ever worked in this organization before if candidate answers yes then another question pops up which i am creating here now uh, it could be like uh, then what was your employee number please mention it okay so that is okay but here we are not creating any conditional question so let's take a look that question classification important area so what kind of the question we are creating what is the purpose of that disqualification question like are you eligible to work in us it could be a disqualification question okay if candidate answers yes immediately when candidate submits the job application he will be rejected okay it could be a knockout question pre screening question added automatically just kind of of the question just you are asking this question you are throwing this question on candidate he just has to answer it that's it just you want to capture it for knowing candidate better no okay. so pre screening question added automatically if i select this one based on this criteria candidate types recruiting organization location families uh, job functions whenever a recruiter is going to create job requisition this question will be added to that requisition automatically you don't have to do anything if i have selected pre screening question added by user it means that this question will not be added to requisition automatically the recruiter has to go into that area pre screening questionnaire there he has to search and he has to add it okay interview feedback if you are using this question for the interview feedback so interview can provide the feedback based on this question okay so here i'm just selecting pre screening question added by user just to recognize this is my question test are you eligible to work in usa okay candidate types i'm selecting both internal and external i can use it okay both. recruiting organization location job families and function you can contextualize it contextualize it based on your requirement okay so what would be a response time you can create any rating model if you have created in talent profile you can select select that but or if you haven't created anything so don't worry we have another way i can select yes what should be a score because we had selected a score above so i'm just giving five or maybe i'll give ten i will select one more so this option yes and no options will be visible to candidate whenever candidate is going to answer this question so he has to select one of these so then i then you come here it's kind of the response type what do you want single choice of from list the radio button is radio button with image okay i believe that image doesn't work but uh, every time oracle is announcing so you can look uh, you can look forward to the future releases of uh, oracle so there it will be definitely it will be working okay so here what i am going to do i'm just going to save and close once you will save and close here you can see 
this question has been created. Let's see whether we can use this this question into the requisition or not. Okay, so I'll go back to home page. I'll go to hiring. We'll create add. I'll take an position. Okay, I'll create. Okay, so hmm. let's create the existing position. Huh? He add generate is fine. So we don't need to select multiple fields. There's so many. <laughs> okay, I'll just keep moving forward. Oh, 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 this is required. Okay, details for the requirements. Posting description. You know, it is a big problem in ORC. You have to select all that you can reach at towards the end. There should be a way to Page configuration attachment offer in for question is directly, but this is a problem. Okay, so this question you can see that already it was coming there. Okay, do you have the legal right to work in this country? So now you can see you remember that we had created that question. Question classification was pre screening question added by user. That's the reason it is not showing up here, but we need to come. Okay, search your question and here you got it. I have added it to the internal pre screening questionnaire. It means whenever internal candidate is going to apply this job through external career site, oh sorry, through internal career site, then he will be able to see view this question. And external candidates they can also see this question once I'll be adding it. Here. Here we go. So I have so in this video we have created question and based on a requirement we can create this qualification question, pre screening question and then it will be divided into two parts so whether it should be added automatically to a requisition or it should be added by a recruiter or hiring manager or user I can say okay and then interview question and we have created that so we have shown this example so I think it's pretty much clear that you can go and you can submit this information I hope you enjoyed this video thank you so much thank you have a nice day stay safe